make a circle. Yes. Okay. Um, we're going to do a exercise. And in this exercise, I want you to, in this circle, find two people you take secretly in your head. Just to see what happens. Yeah. 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 
Let's take, take two more, just to see what happens. Yeah. If you need to change because she walked, you have to change now. <laughs> yeah, if she moves because she moves, and you have to change because she moves, you have to move now also. That's all. Okay. Let's go back to the circle. The most activity features. Okay. What was this exercise about? Yes. What more? It, it shows the exercise that the world is a living system. <laughs> because of your behavior, you will influence other people's behavior. If you, if somebody walks, uh, somebody else will walk too. If you say, I love this movie, some of your friends will go see it too. If you say, I hate this movie, some others may sing, I want to see it anyway. So when I give the assignment, you find your own place, what happens is we all adjust to each other. All good willing people in the world, they create a balance for the whole system. Yeah, some of you are excellent teachers because you bring structure and safety. But some of your colleagues will think she's so structured and so much about safety, let's create some more play. Yes, and a, and a third one will think they should bring more new content. So each of you brings something to the system what the others are not seeing enough, you think. And so if we then work from our own way to create balance in the system, we make the system stronger and better. Yeah, but then if you are in a school and also in this exercise you go, no, this can't work, no, no, this can't work, no, in my brain this doesn't work. You either block the system to be balanced or you make it everybody have to work hard later again. Yes, and I bet some of you, while you were walking, trying to fit, you were thinking, this is not possible, this cannot work. <laughs> yes, who had that? Yes, some of you, when you were 
те, що це неможливо. Yes, who, who was uh, thinking this cannot work? Хто думав з вас, що це не спрацює? Yes, so the ones that thought it cannot work but worked anyway, applause. А ті, хто думав, що це спрацює, So you took about uh, two and a half minutes. My record is with 60 people, 25 seconds. <laughs> the worst is 15 minutes. With HR managers, human resource managers. <laughs> You know them. Yeah. Uh, and what happened? They started to say, "No, no, this is not possible." Okay, let's make a plan. So we discuss how this can work. And others said, "No, no, this cannot work." And others said, "Вони почали з того, що сказали, що це неможливо, і почали розробляти якийсь план." Yes, and others said, "Okay, you. Who belongs to her? Who belongs to her? Let's find out." Yes. No, no, no. Who belongs? No. So they, so they tried to control it. And, and the control created more time, chaos and fights and So your job is also to find your balance to the system, to heal help the system, just as with the singing we did in my TED talk. Ваша робота в тому, що ви повинні знайти цей баланс і якось балансувати в системі. So what can you do from your vision to strengthen the whole system? Що ви особисто ви можете зробити для того, щоб підсилити підсилити цю систему? Yeah, find a partner, make two sums. Знайдіть партнера. Right now, so yes, right now. Yes. No, no, this is public. Yes. Pairs, work and pairs. Make pairs. Yeah, you have to sit in the... Yes. So what I will do is with my partner, I will make an interesting uh, proposal what we can do together here and that will be fun for the both of us. <laughs> yes. And you. <laughs> and your assignment is to say no in the in the most terrible way possible. <laughs> like oh no. no. <laughs> yes, also so not only say no, but also mentally. So I should. Я повинна я говорю якісь емоції показувати. А вони зробити певну пропозицію. Так. Yeah. So shall we dance the tango here? No. Anna, just understand how romantic it would be. So one is very enthusiastic, and the other break it down. Yes. Один, тобто ентузіаст, а інша людина постійно жме. Yes. Everybody ready? Ready? Start.
One of you makes the proposal, the other says immediately yes, and you immediately go do it. Yes. There, are some, there are some rules. There are some rules. Yes. Yes. So uh, the first is don't cross boundaries. Don't leave the room. <laughs> Don't destroy the, en the, the environment. <laughs> <laughs> and if, if somebody does a proposal you don't like, so if you say, let's dance, she has to dance, but she can, as soon as she doesn't like it anymore, she may change it to something new. Or make it more interesting. Shall we stand on one leg? Oh, and let's up with it, yes? So whenever you have an idea, you may come with, with the idea and you immediately go do it. Are you all ready? Go! Child should learn to walk like this. 
Тоді чому більша частина освіти? Принципи освіти базуються на тому, що там воно розказує. Ні, ні, ні. Тоді чому в освіті ми маємо дуже багато теорії і мало дуже правил? So trying to fall and fall and then try again and fall and try again fall, you learn a lot. My talent for a long I used to be super shy. My talent was to die in front of groups. Which, which means make big mistakes. And I still make mistakes. In my TED talk, I talk too long and she couldn't follow anymore. It was my mistake. Коли я робив те ток сьогодні, я дуже багато і довго говорив, і перекладач не мав не встигав перекладати. Вона не мала можливості. No, but but then for her it would be interesting to learn to say first stop. I can't imagine you. Я не можу уявити, як я кажу first stop. My students also dare to say stop to me. And they're not afraid to say first it doesn't work for me. That's what doesn't work for me. So they're, they're, and then we have a dialogue and we learn together. So, uh, now I want you to go to your bag or whatever you have and take one, and take one little crazy object. Yes, good. Yes. Don't push it on. Okay. Um, go sit somewhere in this room with your object on your own. And then I give you a sign. А, вот там есть пустые стулья. Yeah, you have to sit somewhere that you are alone with your object. So it's not with others, so it's a private moment exercise. So you can also go to the back or away from your neighbors. So now comes the exercise and it's a private exercise. You have now seven minutes for yourself and this object. If you have a phone, don't put it on, just the object. Don't put it on, just see it as an object. 
Просто використовують його як предмет, але не як таймер. Yes, seven minutes for you and your object. Have fun. Сім хвилин для вас і вашого предмета. Private exercise, no talking. Okay, thank you. The exercise now, write a poem about you and the object. It doesn't need to rhyme. But it is poetry.
And when your poem is ready, you come uh, forward and sit about here, so that I can see I'm ready. Yeah, bring us chair. Bring your chair. Ми можемо зрозуміти. 
every moment is a moment that you express yourself, whether it's кожного моменту ви якось виражаєте, виражаєтесь, проявляєтесь, да? І наступає такий момент, момент інсайту. So, um, poetry and this expression of what just you wrote is also expression of something that you are aware of and happened, and this poem can always bring you back to this moment. Вірш чи поема, яку ви щойно написали, може вас як повернути до того моменту, до попереднього моменту, чи це якась, це якийсь наступний крок. So, this is my integral education model. Це модель інтегральної розвитки. So why should models be look boring and like uh, strict and structure, etc.? I'm still working on the poem that goes with this one. So very short, tomorrow I'll go deeper into this, but very short. Yeah, most education only train the head and a little bit of cap cap capacity of a little bit of that you can do it. But a good education works with head, heart and hands. Who of you loves their job? <coughs> and the students feel that. Even if you're very strict, it comes from if it comes from love, they will know. This model also has guts, courage. Uh, who of you, while writing your poem, were, uh, how do you say, um, keep it, keeping it simple or uh, leaving things out because you felt that's exposing too much? Хто з вас, коли ви писали віршика, якісь речі викидав, тому що ви вважалися, що цього забагато. І намагалися створити ваш віршик якомога простішим. So, very honest. So, creativity is also about courage. Do you dare to express yourself? Креативність – це теж про хоробрість. Чи зможете ви проявити себе? Yeah. Then, yeah. then in modern education there's the circle of the world. What is your job doing in the world? With education this is easy, it's beautiful. But some people take the job, as I said in my TED talk, to throw more plastic in the ocean. Багато людей ходять на роботу для того, щоб викидати більше пластику в океан. Or lobby against the, with Mr. Trump that climate change does not exist. Чи є такі люди, які також побіють з Трампом те, що глобального потепління не існує? Yes, so how do we Somebody says yes to that well-paying job, but so how do we stop them from realizing, uh, or how do we help them to realize that such jobs are destructive? Як ми можемо донести до наших учнів, що певні професії вони мають руйнівну силу? That also means that sometimes they need to say no, even to you as a teacher. Тому важливо, щоб вони мали собі сили сказати вам ні, також навіть. 
And if the only reaction you have is to bring back discipline and order, they will never learn how to say no to bosses that make crazy or bad commands. So, and in your profession you need to have system thinking, which is understanding how the world as a whole works. And have intuition. So like a poli some politicians, they speak and you feel yes, and other speaker you go, it sounds good, but it's terrible. Our intuition helps us make good choices. But for this we also need to learn to distinct intuition from our anxieties and our imagination. Yeah, you meet a tall, dark stranger in an alley. Strong, big stranger in an alley. How do you... Yeah, so how do you know that your that it is anxiety that you go, oh my god, he must be a Muslim terrorist. <laughs> and that this is a thought in your head, but the picture is unreal. Or that indeed your gut feeling says, this is danger, I need to be not here. Yeah, so we need to train all these things and also in system thinking, if you have a job like uh, selling mortgages, hypotheca, uh, mortgages, hypotheca. Ah, okay. and you get your target, Still, the economy can come, come, go down, like in 2008. Or you as teachers get your targets, like all good figures, but the students are still suffering. So I ask you, what is it that you have to learn? What is the question you carry yourself? And I want you to take a new page, take a new page in your paper, and write down your question. What is it that you need or want to learn for yourself in your personal question, learning question? So not how does democratic education work, but personal learning question. How can I bring more joy to the school? How can I have more courage? How can I be more creative? Yes? Personal learning question. Write down this question.
Has everybody written down their question? Yes. Who has not yet written down a question? Everybody? Good. Now we have a surprise. You have a question. And you have a poem. The answer to your question is in your poem. So, who wants to come forward here and find out? Who wants to come forward and find out? Who wants to find out? Find out the answer. Yeah, you can also be number two, but we start with her. You're number three, and then we have to round it up. No, you can just sit there. I know you're number three. Yeah? Where are you coming from? Sit. No, sit. We, we just start. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Oh, stop. First, you read the question to everyone. How can I become less strict to my students? Okay, yes. Now can I hear the poem? Can you read it uh, one by one and let she thinks it? <laughs> yes? Clean up the strictness and let your heart 
much more shiny. First question. What should I learn to have a good health? Yeah, good question. something nice or uh, a beautiful person or or uh, kids playing and then well I can't I can't play with them because that would look stupid so we we uh, limit ourselves so if you see something yes so if you see something attractive and, and it's there for the taking take it so, um, I can't do this for everyone, but you can, because you're teachers. So make small little groups of four or five people, four people, four, make small little groups of four people. Yeah, choose people you want to have lunch, uh, dinner with. Yes, so you right now stand with four people you want to have dinner with. Don't go yet. Um, with the people you chose to have dinner with, you put your question forward 
read your poem and together with them you try to listen how is my answer in the poem. Now, for those of you who want to think, one day I will do this exercise with my own group. Two things are very, very essential. One, you have talent to hear the answer in the poem. A trick is that sometimes when somebody asks how can I be more fun, you replace the whatever the object is with the word fun. Or uh, with the proper person they have problems with. So, so you, and sometimes you can test what if we turn the word uh, me and my apple into me and my fun or me and my mother or so you test different words until you feel now the person lives up and this is the answer. Okay, вы можете практикувати з разними словами, ви можете їх замінювати в ваших віршах, доки ви не отримаєте відповіді. The, the second absolute essential is that when you write the poem, you don't know it's the answer to the question. Основна мета цього завдання, що коли ви пишете вірш, ви не знаєте, що це вже відповідь на якесь питання. Yeah, mostly I take much more time to be with the object and much more time to write the poem. Більшості людей потрібно більше часу на те, щоб побути з цим предметом, і більше часу на те, щоб написати вірш. Because if you write the poem, or the question with thinking about the poem, you go into your own mental blur. When, when you do this too conscious and mental, then you write down what you already, how you already always think. So the invitation to be with an object, not understanding why, takes you out of your normal thinking to a deeper level. That's why some of you go really, and others, and that's okay. Всі мали дуже різні відчуття стосовно того предмету, який ви обрали. Ну, це нормально. So, uh, this is a, also shows how deep we have knowledge about what we work, want for ourselves and that we also can start gigging with our students that they can learn how to and feel and discover what they really want for themselves. Tomorrow I will work further on these kind of things and other things. So thank you for your attention and have